in this lecture we will fit the windows in the wall so let's see how we can do that so if you want to fit, uh, fit the windows in this wall as you can clearly see that we have already placed the uh, uh, placed the walls placed the doors now it's time for the windows so for that what you have to do is all you need is just to simply type wn from your keyboard to activate the windows command and now after that if you are not interested in using these windows what you can do is you can just simply go and load the family of that window so you have to just simply do a single click here and after clicking on that you you can navigate to whatever country you are looking for so right now i am looking for us so which is here and after that i will look for windows of course so let's go to windows and here i can choose any of the windows i can want you can see So basically I'm interested in this M window sliding double so I can just simply select on that and I'm looking for louvers so this is in windows as you can see here okay now you have to look for louvers there you go there it is lower so again you have to use control and select on that one as well so you can see that we have selected these two m windows lowers and windows sliding double and after that you just simply need to click on open so as you can see here that in lowers you don't have any option for that that's why it is showing that no type catalog available and if you go and click on this m window sliding you can clearly see that you have bunch of these options available so what i will do is i will just simply scroll down okay so i'm looking for one or uh, 1500 into 1200 which is this one where uh, this will be our w1 and if you scroll down if you scroll down Let's look for 1800 into 1200 basically i'm looking for 1800 into 1200 yeah there you go so you have to simply control and select this one as well so i have selected these two okay and then after that i will just simply do a uh, okay here and after that it will take some time and it will show in it will show that windows here okay now you can see that these are the windows uh, you can see now you can fit that one as well so now it's time to look for our plan so if you look at the plan let me open this plan you can see here that uh, these two are window one okay so and these four are window two and we have uh lures here so let me just simply uh, minimize that and here uh, you you can see that right now this one is the window one which is 1500 into 1200 mm so you can just simply select on that and uh, you can see that already this one is selected here in this uh, category which is m window sliding double and now all you need is just to simply take your mouse cursor and you can see the distance here which is at the center if you want to place that at center you can clearly see that it is at center as of now you can see that this one is at 1.5 and 1.5 meter if you feel now you can see that this one is at 1.55 and 1.55 so basically this is a center need to, and you need to take your mouse cursor on the upper side as i've told you earlier as well just like that one you can see that this is at center now similarly like that uh, you, we have to do the same thing on this side as well you can see the distance is uh, almost uh, similar uh, from both side which is at middle so you can just simply select on again you have to take your mouse cursor on the outer side and then click here you can see now uh, this was w1 so uh, what we will do is if you notice here carefully you will see that tag on placement is on that's why we are getting these numbers okay so what you can do is uh, th this is w1 so you can rename that one so we will do that part later on first of all we will place our windows now it's time to place the w2 in this region in this region and in this place and then this place so now I will just simply go and click on this uh, drop down button and from here I will select this 1800 into 1200 mm and after that I will simply take my mouse cursor on the upper hand side I can verify that whether this distance is same or not so basically this is same 2.1 meter 2.1 meter 
again I will do a single click here again I will take my mouse cursor in this direction and I have to verify that whether the distance is same or not you can see the distance is same 1.41 per phone again I will do a single click here now we'll go to this region so I have to look for uh, you can see that this is at center let's simply do a click here I will do the same thing here as well 1.35 1.35 okay uh, let uh, if you notice here you can clearly see that you can actually control this number as well I will show you later let me press escape and now it's time to place the lures so you have to simply click on this one and there you go this is the lures that we are looking for okay you have to just simply do a single click here and after that we will place that lures here at the centers or from the outer direction you can see the distance <laughs> and after that I can press escape now what we will do is we will uh, rename these uh, windows so this was our W1 so all we need is just to simply do a, a click here and then after that I will simply type W1 and then I will hit OK and it will uh, tell me that uh, you are changing a type parameter this could affect my element so basically these two windows are same so it will also rename this window as well so I will just simply type yes so these two windows are now W1 and like that these two and these two which is of four windows these are similar so if we make any kind of changes here in this window or any of these windows uh, it will affect all of these windows so this is our W2 after that let's simply click on yes and you will notice that all of these windows are W2 now now this is lower so I will just simply type here as V and then I can simply click and then click on yes now you can clearly see that we have successfully placed our windows in the walls and successfully renamed that one as well so now uh, you you might have one question that what if if you just uh, don't able to put uh, that window at the centers okay then in that case what you can do is you can just simply select uh, that you can see here you can see you will get all the parameters all the different parameters here let me show you with an examples let me simply type WN and let's uh, take the example of this and here you can actually see uh, the distance from this part to this part you can see here okay you can see that this it is showing you the distance even if you take it from here you can show the distance and later on you can modify that one as well okay let's say uh, you have entered at this point at this point okay so basically this is an exterior point so I will take uh, the example from let me use let me show you let me just simply select on that and you can see that it is showing you that this is 3.7875 so basically what you can do is you can just simply select on that and according to that you can actually input any number you want and it will automatically adjust that so I can enter 4 okay it will shift at that on that side I can just simply select on that I can enter 5 and I can it will shift that side I will just simply press ctrl z ctrl z and ctrl z so even after placing the windows you can actually modify them as per your requirement so this is the end of this lecture